formlizard.com makes it easy to manage registration forms, information forms, complex contracts, or any document that needs to be filled out. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to use conditional fields. Conditional fields allow you to ask just one yes-no question and then add a whole new section to your document or even add new questions to your form depending on the answer. For instance, as part of the school registration interview that I've already set up, Formzard asks, does the student need to take any medications at school, yes or no? The completed form includes a reminder that if parents said yes, they'll also need to complete a medication authorization form. But on a whole page of text, that reminder is easy to miss. So let's add a more prominent notice that will appear on the completed health form only if parents say yes. First, I'll open the original health form in Word. For this example, I'll replace the question, the yes or no field, and the existing reminder with just one field. As always, I save the file in RTF format. And I'll go to the health form that I've already set up on FormLizard and click re-upload to import the revised document. The fields have already been defined, so I just click Finish. Next, I'll write the notice that I'd like to add in. Again, I save my file in RTF format, but this time I upload it to FormLizard as a new form. It doesn't have any fields to define, so I just click Finish. Now I need to tell FormLizard what to do with this new form. I'll go back to the Health form and click on Edit. I select the appropriate field and click on the pencil icon to edit the field. And I'll make this a conditional field. I can choose which form to add in if the user answers yes. In this case, that's the reminder notice we just created. And I can also choose the text to insert if the answer is no. I can leave this space blank or I can add an alternative message. When parents log in to complete their interview, FormLizard will ask them the same question as before, does the student need to take any medications at school? If they say yes, FormLizard will include our new notice as part of their completed health form. If they say no, it won't. Simple. But conditionals can do much more. Instead of just adding a reminder into the health form, let's add in the actual form that they'll need to fill out, this medication authorization form. Since we're making it part of the health form, we don't need to ask for the student's name all over again. And just like any other form, I'll set up my fields, save the file in RTF format, and upload it to FormLizard as a new form. And I define my new fields. Finally, I'll go back to the health form and edit my conditional field again. It's still a conditional, but this time I want to insert the new medication authorization form instead of just the notice. I click finish and I'm done. As before, FormLizard will ask the parents, does the student need to take any medications at school? If they say yes, and only if they say yes, FormLizard will ask them additional questions. And when they're finished with the form, their completed health form will include the new medication authorization section I just set up. Thanks for watching. To learn more, please visit www.formlizard.com.